My lady, are you really going to work on the embroidery yourself? His Majesty's bedclothes have dragon patterns all over them. The trip starts after a three-day stay in the Summer Palace. I don't think we can make it in time, my lady. I see. What should we do then? Calling me fat? Now I'll make you look fat. Greetings, Your Majesty. Let's dispense the pleasantries. What? You came to watch me review the reports? I don't think now is a good time. I will wait until Your Majesty is no longer occupied. In your mind, I am incompetent? You think I would be disturbed just by a few words? Of course not, Your Majesty. There is no doubt that Your Majesty can multitask easily. But what I want you to know is best expressed with a picture. What's embroidered on the bedclothes? It's a tabby cat, Your Majesty. I wanted to embroider a dragon on your garment, but apparently it was beyond my skills. This is immature in techniques, as if it was made by a child. What are you laughing at? It's nothing. I just think that these bedclothes suit your majesty, that's all. How dare you compare me to an animal? Your majesty, you have misunderstood. The orange cat is a very popular mascot amongst the people. I embroidered this hoping that your majesty would be praised by the people. You are really good at talking aren't you? Rather than standing behind me and making a comparison, you might as well personally change the clothes for me. What? Your Majesty, you want me to... Is there something wrong with your ears lately? Do you need me to say it twice? Your Majesty, I'm afraid I'd injure you. Please let Li Yu do it. As my harem, you don't know how to change me? I think you're just making up excuses. Noble Consort Hui.
Greetings, Your Highness. 